everybody before we get into this morning's update i want to go over a quick synopsis of what's transpiring this early sunday morning or late sunday morning now we've got xrp right around the 518 level we're looking for a sign of strength and a close above that 524 pivot level that would be a huge sign of strength here to end the weekend but we'll see if we can get over 528 or 524 that pivot level but if we stay underneath as long as we hold the 50 cents and then we'll look at it a little bit higher up to see where that actual target is where we want to stay above on this thinly traded weekend and then to push up over that 524 before the daily close here on sunday would be such a huge sign of strength but we'll see if we have enough buyers to be able to accomplish that feat we also have tonight the futures market comes on so we'll see exactly how this starts to play out when the futures comes online when the metals market comes back and when the dxy comes back online because as we know it ended the week a little bearish and if we do get rejected around the 106 spot 30, that could bring us down a couple dollars on the US dollar currency index. So that could allow cryptos and risk assets to pump. I wanna put this update out because I gotta leave shortly. I've got my playoff game today. As you know, I coach football. We made it into the playoffs and uh, my game's at three o'clock. And if we win our first game, because we're the two seed, we uh, play in the championship tonight. So we'll see what happens but I'm just glad that we made the playoffs in my first season coaching them. And uh, it was quite the feat to actually make it. So um, besides that, I'm gonna show you the technical analysis on XRP. Please make sure to hit that like button as it will greatly help push me through the analytics and it will help more people come into this beautiful community with each and every one of you. Aside from that, please make sure to hit the like button, consider subscribing and we'll go right into the chart. Good morning, 10.39 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on this Sunday, October 22nd, 2023. I'm XRP Future Millionaire, and I reside in the great state of Michigan. I'll make this a quicker update this morning. We'll get on the same page, and then I got to get ready to get out of here. Um, right now, with the total or the XRP total market cap, we're still trying to get over that 28. What is it about 27.78 billion right now? 27.8 billion. We're looking for a close over on the daily. And we're trying to invalidate this death cross. We are starting to move up here a little bit where we're starting to hold the 200 day as support here in the daily. And now you can see we have a golden cross in the four hourly. And all we're trying to do is hold this support at minimum at 27.37 billion right now. So anything short of that, of a fall through here, this should be another push up and it should get us closer to that 30.8 billion, assuming this plays out truthfully. And then aside from the XRP market cap, if you look at the XRP technical analysis, the, um, the layers we're in, we're still in this bear flag, which it dropped into a bear flag disguised within a smaller bull flag. Well, we're on the top side of this formation. Even if it's a bear flag, bull flag, whatever you want, it's on the top side. And now we're looking at, at the very least, we wanna try to hold this 20 day at 51 cents right now on this golden cross. But as long as you hold this structure and you don't lose around the 505 and ultimately that 50 cent mark, you really don't want to come below that 505 because you want this golden cross to play out. And then if it does, you're going to push up and over this 53.8 cent roughly or 54 cents. And it should bring you somewhere up until about the 55 cent mark. And then we're going to see if we can make a play. If we do break out of this region, we're going to see if we can make a play in the very key is 524 first level pivot, as we talked about. And then you can try to get over that 54 cent area. But after that, let's just say you play true and this breaks out, you're going to be looking at a resistance up here at 62 and a half cents. And this is the rising channel from June of 22 it started. So, and if you come up here, it is about 628. The farther you go, it does hit 63 cents coming across. So that is the most likely scenario. If we can get on top of the 524, hold that properly now that we have this golden cross in the four hourly, we're gonna try to invalidate the death cross and then we're gonna try to get back on board with the weekly golden cross, which will be very much intact this week as this downward spiral projection looks like it's starting to reverse back to the top side as we have a long leg doji here signifying this downward momentum is probably fading away. And now if we can get on top of the 524 in one of these daily closes, it's gonna signal a push to the other direction, to the top side. So is XRP switching from a bearish thesis and starting to switch bullish? We won't know that until first we break over that 538 level. Well, first you break over the 524 to start switching the fortunes, and then ultimately you get back over the five, we'll call it 54 cents pattern formation here in the bear flag disguised within a bull flag. And, um, you break over that and then you have a chance to push to 62 and a half cents. That's what we're looking at. Keeping it simple this morning. I'm XRP Future Millionaire.
please make sure to hit that like button if you appreciate my work hit that subscribe button share this far and wide on social media as it does help with the analytics and remember to turn that bell notification all if you're looking to show me support you can always send a youtube super chat or join tom's army since i don't do paid promotions advertisements or sponsorships of any kind and i don't charge for any of the content and then if you're looking to trade xrp your favorite crypto worldwide users max c and for the USA Femex, and that's all in the video description below and or pinned comments. Have a blessed Sunday, everybody. Make sure to give thanks to your Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and look out for each other. Because if we're on the same page and we look out for each other, we can't lose. Hashtag be better, do better. Hashtag fought assassins. And remember, help one person each and every day. Because if I don't do my part and you don't do your part, it's going to be a slippery slope to 2028.